What's up tennis athletes, it's Chris Heria, and today I'm gonna to be taking you through a complete shoulder workout, working every area of our shoulders in just 10 minutes. Using just your body weight and without lifting a single dumbbell from the comfort of your own home that absolutely anybody can do right now to start getting some real results. And for this to be a complete and effective workout, I've chosen exercises that are gonna engage all three heads of your shoulder, your frontal, your medial, and your rear delt. We'll also be using holds in combination with repetitions to build strength, endurance, and muscle simultaneously. And we'll be doing each exercise for time, 45 seconds on 15 seconds off to ensure that we're prioritizing the quality of each rep versus just counting repetitions and going through them without proper muscle connection all that is going to guarantee that you're getting the most bang for your buck for your entire workout as well as doing each exercise for 45 seconds straight is also going to increase the time under tension which is going to help us reach hypertrophy and build more muscle and with the minimal rest of 15 seconds between each exercise it's going to have our heart rate up and allow us to burn fat while simultaneously building muscle so if you're ready to get started all you're going to need to do is just download the Thenix app in the app store or google play store open up to the YouTube workout section, you should be able to find this routine, smash the like button on this YouTube video, and then we're ready to go. The first five exercises of this workout, we're going to be using all isometrics exercises, all holds to build strength and muscle. First one being one of the best holds you can ever train, the tuck planche hold. Not just conventional strength, but straight arm strength as well. So make sure to keep your arms straight when doing this exercise. So let's get down to the ground. We're going to put our hands down, fingertips pointing outwards, and we're going to lean forward until our feet get off the ground. If your feet don't get off the ground, just pick one foot up. If that's too difficult, keep both feet down, but make sure you're pushing down and you're leaning forward, pushing the majority of your weight onto your shoulders. So we're gonna go for two sets of 15 seconds with a 15 second break in between. Let's go for it. Choose your progression. Here we go. Here we go, last couple seconds. Three, two, one. Go ahead, take a 15 second break. Relax as much as you can. Relax the shoulders. Breathe in through your nose. Out through your mouth. Three, two, let's get right back into it. Three, two, one. All right, there we have it. The tuck planche is a pretty tough move to so make sure you work on the first progression and work your way up. So that was a killer for our frontal and medial delts. Coming up next, we're gonna destroy our rear delts with reverse plank hold. So we're gonna get down into a push-up position, turn over, bring your hips up. We're gonna hold this 45 seconds. Squeeze your rear delts. Make sure your hips are up and engaged. Make sure to squeeze your rear delts the whole entire time. More than halfway there. Make sure you're pushing down on your palms. Hold it, we're almost there. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Whew. If that's the first time you've ever tried that, you're probably surprised at how pumped you actually are without doing any reps and just holding. Next up, we have parallel hold, engaging our entire shoulders. I'm gonna use the top of these two chairs. You can pretty much use anything in your house. So from this position, you wanna depress your scapulas, push them down. You can just hold it just like this, squeeze your core. See, I have my arms locked out. Or you can really work your shoulders. Halfway there. Here we go. Hold it nice and high. Five, four, three, two, and one. Whoo! Nice little burn. The pump is real right now. The next exercise we're gonna get into is gonna be more of a dynamic hold with 90 degree hold toe taps. So there's progressions to this too. Let's get down on the ground. I want you to choose whatever level that you're at. So fingers out, lean forward, hands down by your side. This is the first progression, just hold this. If this is too easy, just start alternating your toes. This is the actual progression. Music. 
Almost there, keep going. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! Sheesh, my shoulders are on fire right now. So that was a killer for your shoulders, but now we're gonna emphasize on our medial delts with high side plank raises, 22 seconds on each side. So we're gonna get into a push-up position, move to the side, hips all the way down, then all the way back up. Squeeze the ground so you don't lose your balance and you work your stabilization muscles. Of course, this is too difficult. You can always go down onto your elbow to a side plank. Here we go, three, two, and one. Let's switch. Here we go, we're almost there. Last five seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, Whew. we are officially halfway done with this routine. Now we're gonna start getting into our reps. We're gonna use the chairs one more time for the next exercise, emphasizing on our rear delts. That's gonna be wide body rows for 45 seconds. Turn the chairs to the side, come down, bend our knees, roll all the way up. Make sure to keep your body nice and flat. Last 10 seconds, here we go. Five, four, three, two, and one. Whoo! My rear delts are on fire right now. The next exercise, emphasizing on our medial and frontal delts, is gonna be the elevated pike push-up. Just gonna put our feet on an elevated surface, walk all the way up into a pike position, Come down with the crown of your head and back up. For all my beginners out there, I want you just doing a normal pike push up on the ground or just holding a pike hold. Pace yourself. Make every single one as perfect as possible. Last 10 seconds, here we go. Five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! We're down to the last three exercises. The next one coming up, emphasizing on our rear delt. That's gonna be a body weight rear delt fly. I'm gonna use these two ottomans, get right in the middle, hold my body up with my elbows or my triceps, let my body go in, and then push my elbows out. Come back in, push my elbows out. Now this one you can take your time on. You want to get a real good quality contraction every single time. Get to the top, squeeze, hold if you can. Come right back down, controlled. Don't rush the eccentric portion of this exercise. Ten seconds, here we go. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, whoo. My rear delts are on fire. This next shoulder exercise is gonna be another strength and muscle builder. We're gonna go for pike walkouts. Pike up, we're gonna walk out just as far as you can. If this is as far as you can, stop right here and start walking back up. If you can go further, even better. Walk all the way back up. Highest point. Touch one foot. Touch the other foot. Come back down. Last 
Last 10 seconds, here we go. Five, four, three, two, and one. Whew. All right, we are down to the last and final exercise, elevated high plank to pike press. For all my beginners, you can just do this move with your feet on the ground. So this is how we're gonna get into it. Put our feet elevated, get into a pike position, not too piked, to be able to come back down forward, and then press back up with our arms straight, come right back down with our arms forward. We're gonna repeat. When you come back down, make sure you push your body up, hips up, and you keep your arms straight. Come back down, control the movement. Push your body up. Come back down, nice and controlled. Almost there. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Whew. That is officially the end of this killer shoulder routine. My shoulders have a crazy pump. They are on fire. And best of all, we did it with pretty much no equipment from the comfort of our own home. So there is no excuse for you not getting in the best shape of your life. Whether you're a beginner or advanced, this workout is gonna kick your butt and it's gonna be super effective. For not only building muscle and solid shoulders, but also for developing the strength that's required for the most advanced calisthenic skills like the full planche, full planche push-up, handstand push-ups, 90 degree push-ups, and so much more. Not just looking strong, actually being strong. So if you enjoyed the workout routine, definitely smash that like button. Don't forget to come back to this workout every time you need to train shoulders to make sure you're getting a complete shoulder workout. And to get this workout on your phone, make sure you download the Thenix app in the App Store or Google Play Store and get full access to all our workout programs, technique guides teaching you all the hardest moves like the full planche and handstand push-ups, and daily workouts that are gonna have you burning fat and building muscle simultaneously. And join the millions of other Thenix athletes around the world using the Thenix app right now to get in the best shape of their lives. And if you enjoyed the video, make sure you smash that like button. We really appreciate it. it helps YouTube share our videos to more people out there and to show our appreciation if you comment down below within 30 minutes of any upload you always have a chance to win some Thenx apparel so make sure you've hit the subscribe button right now if you haven't already with the bell notifications on so that you never miss a video we post every single Sunday by 8 p.m. USA Eastern Time and for more of my content during the week make sure you're following my blog channel that's youtube.com slash Chris make sure you're following me on Instagram that's Chris Heria as well and I just opened my brand new TikTok. my handle there is Chris Heria 305 and as of right now I don't have any followers or even even engagement on my brand new TikTok. So make sure to follow me right now to get my exclusive content that you'll only find on TikTok and comment on every TikTok video for your chance to win a free weight vest. And with that said, how about commenting down below right now? Let me know what you want the next video to be about and I'll see you next Sunday, 8 p.m. USA Eastern Time. Mad love and peace out.